it's time for your morning talker. You know, bounce houses are always popular for kids and at kids' parties, but are they clean is the question. I'm going to say no. Uh, companies <laughs> say they clean and disinfect after every rental, but how good of a job, you wonder, might they do? You're not there yet, but no. my kids went to many bounce house parties when they were younger, and uh, they were also often sick when they were younger. So maybe that has something to do with it. <laughs> Check it out. Our sister station in Phoenix pulled out the filth finder to investigate Yuck. this story. Keep in mind, if you're not familiar with the filth finder, <laughs> it works by finding out how much living material is on something. It could be cells, bacteria, you get the idea. And depending on, or depending on what that living material is, again, it could make you sick. So a score under 30 means it's okay, over 30 means it's dirty. Okay, so we're gonna put the first bounce house to the test. You can see the delivery guy wiping it down there in the background. Well, let's do the swab test. This step, which every kid, the step part of it, every kid touches that, comes in at 220, almost nine times the limit. Again, That's over so 30 gross. is dirty. That was 220. <laughs> oh. Then they let the kids loose in the bounce house. An hour later, that step was measured again, and it was a lot higher, 778 oh, now. And then inside the bounce house, yep, as you can imagine, things aren't much better. Taking the average from two different spots inside the bounce house, the interior came home with a score of 225. Again, almost nine times the limit. Doctors say this is really no surprise. It's kid feet, it's, it's kids handling food, it's kids touching one another and rolling all over one another, picking their nose, dabbing their eye, dirty diapers. He lost That's me at picking the nose. <laughs> well, they also tested bounce houses at bigger parties. So for the kids, when the kids got in the inside, registered at 421. An hour later, it blew away the other tests more than 2,000, almost 100 times the limit. Wow. And the step just filthy. It measured almost 4,000. That's 131 times the limit. So the takeaway here, Maybe not expect it to be clean or sanitized. Wow. I'm going to say, is it reasonable to put my kid in a hazmat suit for I just parties? Can't. I felt myself rooting for the higher oh numbers, my gosh. strangely. And yet we all survived. <laughs> Imagine that. Isn't that amazing? <laughs> True. That yes. was, by the way, we're going on record. That was the longest story we've ever brought you on the Sunrise Show. The filth finder. <laughs> I'm going to guess that this news desk would come in at about 600. Oh, isn't yeah. that the truth? That's yes. what we should swap. Not on my Hands side. Off. I sanitize mine yeah, daily. Yeah, you do. Okay. You're one of those No, no, no. Guys. Don't touch the desk. The rest of no, the newscast. Okay. Ashley, hands off. Back hands away. Off, please. <laughs> my, All right. My spot's clean. Is it my turn? Is that right? Yeah.